Welcome. We've got Walden Wilson from the Flinders Park Football Club in Division 3, and he's doing our 60-second rapid fire. Nickname? Wilbur. Wilbur? Yes. Three people you would like to have dinner with, alive or dead? Oh, that's a hard one. I'd probably have to go uh, Bob Marley. Yeah. Uh, I'd also go probably Nelson Mandela and yeah. my mum. And your mum? Yeah. Okay, gee, that's one out of the box. <laughs> and uh, who had it? Uh, Flinders Park, who's, uh, who's the snappiest dresser, mate? Uh, that'd probably have to go to Scotty Miller. He doesn't like, uh, he doesn't mind suiting up all the time, so... Anyone else? Anyone else? Anyone oh. else snapping? Yeah, no, nah, Thomas Dunny, like, he's pretty much up there with Tom, uh, Scotty Miller there. Okay, and the biggest bogans, who's the worst dressed with the flannelette <laughs> shirts and moccasins, there's always a flute for Flinders Park. Yeah, right? unfortunately, I have to claim that one myself. If you ask me to around, yeah. I'm always rocking up in my flannies and trackies and thongs. How yeah, about others? There must be some others that you can oh, track out on the bus. Yeah, no, nah, not that come to mind, I'm sorry. No? Yeah, everybody's usually pretty uh, well dressed compared to me. And uh, any man buns there, mate? We've got to out the man buns. Who's got the man uh, buns? Yeah, there's a few of us there, and yeah. myself included. Yeah, we've got to get rid yeah. of it, so we've got to drop the unit. So you've got the man bun. Who else yeah, got the man uh, buns? Uh, what's his name? Jason Stott. He's got one, he's uh, one of our C graders, yep. young bloke. Uh, another one would be uh, Lukey McDonald. Yep. And uh, who else? That's what comes to mind at the moment, sorry. And Kenneth hasn't got a rule yet to just get rid of man buns. They have got to be able to take it out of football. <laughs> no, nah, he hasn't brought anything yet. Uh, hoping he doesn't bring in at all. <laughs> uh, uh, who, who wears the most hair care product while they're there at, uh, at oh. Fulham's Park? Oh, I wouldn't have a clue. Bit the of moment, the old so. moose, no? Nah, uh, yeah, I do use a bit of it myself, but other than that, uh, I'll probably, yeah, get Scotty Miller doing the same. Scotty Miller? Yeah. Okay, and who hogs the mirror there at uh, Flinders Park, you reckon? That'd have to be Chad Comer. He, he, he hogs it? Flex, yeah. Likes the flex in the most. Yeah, he, he, he likes the flex. He, he spends a bit of time in the gym. Okay. So, yeah. Who comes to training with the best stories after their success on the night pub circuit with the ladies? Oh, that will have to be uh, Cooper Seacamp. Yeah, any others? Uh, Generally, there's a few. Can yeah, you some really uh, good stories? yeah, you hear a few bit for, uh, a bit from uh, Thomas Dunn as well. Okay. Uh, every now and then a bit of uh, from Karen Hall. Okay. Yeah. So you get a few do all right from themselves? Yeah, no, they, they do pretty good. Uh, who would you least likely to want to room with on the end of season trip? Uh, that'd probably have to be Kieran Hall. Kieran Hall? Yeah. Most likely to get locked up on that end of season trip? Uh, probably have to go with either Kieran Hall or uh, Kieran Johansson. Yeah, excellent. So you dropped a few in tonight. <laughs> and last but not least, you can bottle your worst fart. Who are you going to release it on out of the playing group? Oh, I'd probably have to go with uh, Oliver McDowell. Fantastic. Thanks for doing our 60 seconds with. Thank you. Thanks, Walter.